This product is legal in California for racing vehicles that shall never be operated upon a public highway. AEM holds no responsibility for any engine damage that results from the misuse of this product. Before verifying the firmware, please save your calibration files. Also, disconnect the USB cable from the FIC and make sure no power is going to the unit. To verify the firmware, first click on File and then select Get Slave Version. Follow the prompts in this window. Make sure the vehicle is not running or powering the FIC. If you're not sure if the vehicle is powering the FIC, disconnect the harness. Plug the USB cable into the FIC and wait at least two seconds, then click Continue. During this next step, you'll need to access the reflash button on the FIC, which is seen here. Again, make sure the vehicle is not running or powering the FIC. If you're not sure if the vehicle is powering the FIC, disconnect the harness. Unplug the USB cable from the FIC. Press and hold the reflash button while you plug the USB cable back into the FIC. Continue to hold the reflash button down for 5 seconds. Then click continue. The firmware version is now shown. Click on OK to continue. To flash the FIC, go to File and select Flash FIC. When the reflash window opens, select X300 or higher. X files are calibration and software firmware. Follow the prompts in this window. Make sure the vehicle is not running or powering the FIC. If you're not sure if the vehicle is powering the FIC, disconnect the harness. Plug the USB cable into the FIC and wait at least two seconds, then click continue. Again, make sure the vehicle is not running or powering the FIC. If you're not sure if the vehicle is powering the FIC, disconnect the harness. Unplug the USB cable from the FIC. Press and hold the reflash button while you plug the USB cable back into the FIC. Continue to hold the reflash button for 5 seconds. The FIC is now in reflash mode. Click continue. The FIC will begin reflashing. This may take a few moments. Wait until you see the flashing completed message in green and then click OK. Disconnect the USB cable from the FIC and then repower the FIC to do a hard reset. Repeat this procedure to load the appropriate Z fueling firmware which may be necessary for certain vehicles. For more information on which fueling firmware should be used, please consult your local AEM tuner, the AEM Electronics Forum, or AEM Tech Support.